Hello viewers, welcome to another tutorial and today I'm going to be showing you how to make a clay render. Now, if, you're not on, if you don't know what a clay render is, it's basically where you give your entire project a single white matte material just so you, you know, it's how people do lighting, it's how people, you know, when especially when they're modeling, when they're modeling they use clay renders to get a good idea on how the model will look before it's textured, just to make sure they got every bit right. So, this is extremely simple to do. So we have a scene right here, and we're going to add uh, just a random object just so we can give it the material. So I'm just going to add a UV sphere, I'm going to add the material, and just call this clay. So very simple, I turn the diffuse up, turn the specular down, and we have a basic white matte material. After you've done that, go to here, where it says material, and it's, well, I've done clay twice, so press clay. And what should happen when you render it, you will get a clay render. And the render is done, and you can see we have our clay render. Everything is the same material, as opposed to having their own individual materials. And if you want to take this off, just, you know, just click the X next to the material and it will go back to normal. And if you want, you know, you're seen to be better lit if for just so you can see the materials better. Well, not the materials, so you can see the uh, models better. Uh, go to the world settings and just switch on ambient occlusion, and you pretty much have, you know, it's much better lit than what it would be with just you know these lights here. So that was a really quick tip for Blender. Hopefully this has helped you out with your modeling or your lighting or whatever you're doing. And that's pretty much it for me. I'm Hayden, and goodbye, viewers.